Hey Stringies, I am the String Player Gamer and welcome to my 2016 Year Ender Vlog. And if you enjoyed watching, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Twenty sixteen was a very productive year for me. I published forty plus music videos. I launched four different albums, including volume two and three of my Undertale Strings of Determination collection, my twenty fifteen VGM covers compilation, and this new one which I'm announcing just now. Here's my twenty sixteen compilation album called Restart. Here's a sneak peek. This is also the year that I went beyond 90,000 subscribers. That is something I could never imagine back when I was starting YouTube in 2009. And it's all thanks to you guys. Thank you very much. I'd also like to thank all of you who at one time in your life became my supporter through Patreon. You guys rock! And so, if you want to get a free mp3 of every music cover that I upload and you want to be one of the first to see a newly uploaded music video, behind the scenes secret information, and possibly getting a personal music lesson from me, do consider supporting me on Patreon. You may have noticed a gradual shift of style for my recent covers. This is because ever since I got my NS Design 5-string electric violin, I found that it can fit more diverse styles of music because of the sound effects that I can apply to it that I could not normally do to a normal acoustic violin. And since I also love metal and rock music, my newer arrangements tend to lean towards that style. But of course, I'm not abandoning my signature hybrid orchestral style of arrangement. I'm just merely taking a break from it. But I wanna hear from you. Are you happy with this rock metal violin style that I've been doing so far? Let me know in the comments. One big change that I made for my music videos this year is abandoning the use of green screen and instead going for the classic look and feel of a black background. It started as an experiment but I eventually stuck to it because I found it simpler to produce but still very professional looking. What do you guys think? Do you want me to continue using the classic black background? Or do you miss my crazy green screen special effects? Let me know in the comments. I recently made my very first Q&A video and I consider it to be a total success. But what if instead of doing one seasonal Q&A video where I answer maybe 10 to 20 questions and the video will last maybe 20 to 30 minutes long, what if I do a question of the week video where I pick one of your cool questions and answer it? And because it's just one question for the entire video, I can give a more elaborate and more complete answer. Let me know what you think about that. So what's in store for the future of my YouTube channel? Simple. I will keep on making music covers that makes me and you happy. That's it. 